Hi, and welcome to the Estes Park News Weekend Report. I'm Chris Hazelton. The 27th annual Catch the Glow Parade will brighten downtown Estes Park this Friday at 5.30 p.m. We're extremely lucky to have as parade director once again the very creative and multi-talented Michael Young at the helm. Michael and his crew started working on the floats in Barn W out at the fairgrounds in mid-September. Michael told us this job is truly a labor of love for him. This year, the parade will feature over 40 units, including 21 floats, marching bands, service vehicles, and much more. Let's take a sneak peek with Michael in the barn as he puts the finishing touches on the floats for the parade. It's totally for the kids, because then everybody joins in. Mm -hmm. I tried to scan, I tried to capture a lot of different areas of, of, of Christmas. The ice castle, of course. Mm -hmm. um, I've always wanted to just capture the fantasy and something done with lights and um, the colors and the lights of childhood and that goes by. I, I want every float to distract everybody from the float before or the float after. Oh, that's I want them to. I want them to be so enthralled with the float in front of them. And so that's why the castle. Spruce, the dragon, he just had to be. Um, I knew I had to build a dragon first, because that was foremost in my brain. Mm -hmm. And then I thought, well, what would a dragon be doing in a Christmas parade? Without my daughter's presence. Mm -hmm. Perfect. You call him Spruce, you give him red and green, mm -hmm. and uh, give him a sort of a wise, knowing expression. <laughs> and once again, I hope I get the, I hope the kids are just in the wall. Enjoy the trip up here to Estes Park and come see the Cast the Globe Parade. And uh, I guarantee you, you'll have a great time and so will the whole family. Come on up and enjoy your holiday season. Prior to the parade, beginning at noon on Friday, children can visit with Santa and enjoy hay rides, whimsical characters, and festive carolers who will entertain throughout the downtown area all afternoon. Then, at 5.30 p.m., the Catch the Glow Parade kicks off and will feature thousands of tiny twinkling lights, storybook figures, angels, snowmen, marching bands, entertainers, wildlife characters, and of course, Santa Claus ends the parade. And don't forget, the weekend of fun extends as Santa's workshop takes over the Estes Park event complex on Saturday. Santa will be at his workshop to entertain kids with many fun, hands-on holiday-themed activities. From 12 to 4 p.m., kids can see the Catch the Go Parade floats up close, decorate trees, create their own gingerbread house, ride in the barrel train, and so much more. Everyone is invited to hear Estes Park's very own Brad Fitch in a special Christmas concert in the McGregor Room at the Stanley Hotel this Saturday at 7 p.m. Don't miss this performance of Christmas classics, John Denver favorites, and songs from Brad's new Christmas album. This will be a great way to begin the holiday season and will be a truly special event. Advanced tickets are just $15 and are available online at cowboybrad.com or call 480-277-5985. Tickets will also be sold at the door for $20. We hope to see you here with us on the 28th of November. And now here's Chloe Libby with a look at your weekend weather forecast. After a relatively warm start to our week, it looks like we're really in for some colder, snowier weather. On Friday, we'll only have highs in the low 20s with lows dipping into the single digits overnight with a 50% chance of snow showers. Bundle up and bring a blanket if you're planning on attending the Catch the Glow Parade. Saturday, we'll have highs near 30 degrees with partly cloudy skies and a 10% chance of snow showers. On Sunday, temps will be about the same as Saturday with a 50% chance of afternoon snow showers moving into our area. Stay warm and have a fun weekend as we move into the holiday season. That's it for this week. Next weekend is Quota Club's Holiday Home Tour and our weekend report will be dedicated to giving you a sneak peek of all five of the beautiful homes and the parade of trees. Thanks for watching. Have a warm and wonderful Thanksgiving with your family and friends and we'll see you out at the parade.